Emory and Henry battling Roanoke College Sunday for the ODAC Championship. Wasp stinging first. Chase Branscombe turns and knocks down the J. Just a tease of what was to come for the former Viking, dropping a game high 29. Wasp now up eight. John Sheeler pulls up and hits the jumper. Ian H up 10. Less than a minute to go. Game knotted at 68. Jordan Davis to the 10 for two. Roanoke up two. But Ian H answers. 40 seconds to go. Branscombe shot off the iron, but Alec Wynn kicks it out to Colin Molden from beyond the arc. Wasp win the ODAC championship, taking down Roanoke College 72 to 70. Feels great, first of all, for our team. Um, the adversity we've been through this year has not been easy on us, but it's been amazing to see how committed they are to each other and to the process of just getting better and competing every day. And to see them rewarded this way just makes me so proud. The past couple games coming into the tournament, I wasn't shooting the ball that well. I was just relying on my post-up game, but you know they told me that I was being a little too unselfish. So, um, you know they hit me in my spots, and I was lucky enough to knock it down. But I got to give all the credit to those guys. I wouldn't have been in the position I was in without those guys giving me the ball. The e &H women also playing for an ODAC title today, facing Randolph Macon. Third quarter, Wasp down one. Maisha Logan hitting the deep two ball. e &H up one. Later in the third, Wasp now down one. Kylie Cooper shot no good, but John Battle's own Chloe Harris there for the putback. e &H up 52-51, but not enough tonight. Final 20 seconds, game tied at 68. Jayla Wade gets the lay-in to drop. Wasp fall to Randolph Macon 72-68.